you guys i am back with another video so today i'm going to show y'all my facial routine i do every night so i use this little blender i have two settings that's faster i always use the number two setting because i feel like the number one really doesn't work on me and then i'm going to show y'all my fridge last because i have my camera set up and I don't want to undo it and then redo it so I'll show y'all my fridge after I'm done with my facial routine so you guys I use a proactive cleanser and I leave it in my facial fridge and I apply it like this I just put dots on my face and it feels cold and it feels really good so I'm gonna put it on the second setting I gotta see you guys I do circular circular I do circular motions I do circular motions all around my face and I do it here. Sometimes it gets like baby hair. It gets in the way. Yeah, it gets in the way like when I do my face. I'm gonna keep doing it and then I do it the opposite. And ladies, if y'all do have oily skin, this also helps with oily skin because I have it really bad. I've always had oily skin and I tried everything to get rid of it and nothing would work. But this actually helps because it deep cleans your um, skin. Now that I'm done with that, I'm going to go rinse off and I will be right back you guys. So next I apply my Miracle Cream. Um, this is for wrinkles and cleans your face for dirt. I always put, on all my products, I just put dots like this. I don't put too much. I don't put too much because a little goes a long way. And you'll be like this in hours just trying to wipe it off. So, I always do it under my eyes. And then on top of my eyes, I'll get wrinkles. And then I just go circular motions. I do this upward like this. And guys, I am all about wrinkle cream. Like I love, I love wrinkle products because I just, when I'm older, my face will be so wrinkly, you know. And that's like the least thing I want is wrinkles. My mama always told me start young with products on your face and I'm like yes queen I just keep rubbing it until I don't feel any more of the um also put some on my neck I forgot to mention that but I didn't put none so well I'll do it next time I just keep rubbing it until I don't feel the product anymore oh you guys I'm I'm like going ahead star I didn't even show y'all the next product I'm gonna use Okay, I use this eye cream. Um, it's also for wrinkles, so I don't get wrinkles under my eyes. And I just grab it like this. And then I put it under my eye. And then a little goes a long way. Like, I put too much on. Like, I put too much, but it's okay. So, I rub it gently in my eyes. Sorry if I'm a liquid, you guys, because I'm like... Trying to get the product out of my eyes. Also, rub it right here on the corners. We have a wrinkle there, and I don't want it to get worse. So, there you guys. So that's my secret. Like some people, they have wrinkles on their eyes when they do eyeshadow. Um, but yeah, I try to avoid that. And I don't think I have creases on my eyelids. I don't know. But I always put eye cream under my eyes. And same thing. I rub it until I don't feel a product anymore. Okay. So next, I'm going to use my roller. Just came out of the fridge. So it's going to feel really coated and nice. So what I do is I do this under the eye. Ooh. I usually use my mirror and I'm scared I'm going to put my but yeah I keep doing this and then I use it on my eyebrow right next I use this big part I go up with my cheek 
Hey guys, this feels so good. And then I go here on my... This supposedly um, takes away wrinkles too, the stone, but I don't know. Let's see. I just use it because it's like a massager and it feels really nice on my skin and it feels good afterwards. And then I do this with my jawline. Also go up. Y'all gonna see a lot of double chin, but I go up like this for my double chin. And then I do this one last time under my eyes. Yes, you guys, I do use a lot of product on my face. And next thing I use is this face hydrate. I mean face moisturizer. Um, this moisturizer is really good. It doesn't feel greasy or anything and I just do little dots because a little does go a long way and I also use this product too when I use my oxy pads I used to rub only my oxy pads without that moisturizing my skin and my sister was like don't do that because your pores are going to clog up and blah 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 so since then I've been using these two and I've seen the difference with my pores my pores aren't that deep. I'm so happy she gave me that advice because she knows more skincare than me. Like she buys products and um, if they're like, she knows what products that is really good for your skin. So um, products that have like bad stuff for your skin, she doesn't buy it, but yeah. She helped me a lot about the moisturizing. I'm gonna stamp it until everything is done. So now, now that I'm done moisturizing, you guys, I'm sorry, I cannot talk today at all. Moisturizing, I think I'm saying it right. Moisturizing, moisturizing. You guys, I could say the word, but I don't know why I cannot say anything today. Then last, I use my uh, night mask. This is a night mask I use, and it's by Dr. Brandt. I really like this product. This one also goes a long way. I always rub my product circular motions. I don't go like straight down or like that. And then I just pat it sometimes, because it also helps faster. I don't know, that's just me. I, it probably doesn't work faster, but it works faster on me. So that's what I do. Now that I'm done with everything, the final stuff I use on my face, tea tree water, which is a toner and it sprays and it feels really good. It keeps your skin fresh and clear and the best toner. I really like this product. This works really good. I don't know if y'all have a Lush near y'all's um, local mall, but these products are really good a while back i bought their curling hair stuff and it works amazing like my curls will pop using it so i got this face stuff love it i love my setting sprays so it's basically like a setting spray yes i do put a lot of the spray because it just feels good it smells good it feels good and you just feel fresh and clean but yeah you guys and i also have my little fan that I use to dry the products on my face. Now that is the end of my facial routine. I'm gonna show y'all my fridge right now. All right, you guys, so this is what my little fridge looks like. Sorry if you hear the rattling, it's my tower. I don't know why it's starting to sound like that, but anyways, so when you open it, I have my face mask, and then I have like my acne stuff here, and inside are all the products I used on my uh, facial, you see my roller back there, my sprays right there, I have my mask, my night mask here, my moisturizer. I have my two wrinkle creams and in this back right here is this serum. I really love it. So I have this 
Glow Facial Serum. I love this product. I use it before I apply my uh, makeup and then my Myriad um, acne stuff. Yeah, that's all I have. But yeah, that is everything in my facial fridge, you guys. I'm also going to rearrange my room, so I'm going to move my facial fridge from this area. But yeah, you guys. Thank y'all for watching. Um, I don't know how long this video is. I will see y'all later, you guys.